Travelers are feeling lucky to be flying in or out of the Sunport today ahead of the cold blast. Action 7 News reporter Justin Matthews is live to show us the impact the storm will have on your travel plans. Justin. I spent several hours here at the Sunport today. It looked like mid afternoon. Crowds were pretty small, but steady. Christine, this is quite literally the calm before the storm. These travelers are not taking any chances. Flying out or arriving in the Duke City days before millions of Americans head to the airport for Thanksgiving. They're avoiding the crowds. In Wednesday, you know, I know it's, it's going to be. Everybody's traveling. We like to take our time. Yeah, we play the travel game <laughs> and uh, it's a little easier. We figured coming on the weekend before Thanksgiving than waiting the week of Thanksgiving. And this year, most importantly, avoiding the weather. We wanted to skip that storm. We keep track of the weather. <laughs> We, we, we keep, keep close track of the weather. State and city agencies are also keeping track of the weather. There's a Sunport snow team. Two dozen people from the airport operations and maintenance teams are ready to go when that storm hits. Sweepers and plows are on standby in case there's snow on the runway. A Sunport spokesperson says it's up to the individual airlines to make sure they're equipped with de-icers during the frigid wet mornings. There's also a lot of you who are driving. Check out this snowplow on I-25 between Santa Fe and Las Vegas, scraping snow off the roads last week. A spokesperson from the New Mexico Department of Transportation says crews have been meeting for the past few days, planning the best ways to get state roads ready ahead of the upcoming storm, with piles of salt and cinder mix in 82 locations across the state, so you don't lose control if you drive over ice. And if you plan on flying like I am in the coming days, the Sunport says we should expect some delays. Live at the Sunport tonight, Justin Matthews, KOAT, Action 7 News. Thank you, Justin. And the busiest travel day of the year for the Sunport is the Sunday after Thanksgiving. <laughs>